It's a big job, moving electricity from where it's produced to where it's used. It's the job of transmission and distribution systems and the people that keep them running. On the largest scale, these power delivery systems are continental networks of major electrical connections, often called power grids. These networks are made up of many individual companies that produce, transmit, and distribute electricity. Each company is primarily responsible for supplying electricity to its own customers. But many individual systems are tied together to form a grid. Now when there's an unusually large demand from an area served by one company, other companies can supply additional electricity through the power grid to meet the demand. With many companies tied into the same power grid, electricity can be distributed in the required amounts to the areas that need it. To do your job in your system, you need to know something about what it takes to get electricity from where it's made to where it's used. You have to be able to recognize the major components that make up a transmission and distribution system. And you have to know what each component does to make the system work. Now, to see how a transmission and distribution system, or T&D system, works, we don't have to look at an entire power grid. Let's look at a smaller part of the big picture and see how an individual company and their consumers fit into the grid. An individual company typically has a number of power plants to provide several sources of electricity within the local system. The power they produce is used by local customers and sometimes sold to other companies on the grid. Even on this level, we still have a fairly complex network. The scale is still too large to see the individual components that take electricity from its source to its destination. To learn what a transmission and distribution system is and get acquainted with its basic components, we're going to look at the simplest possible T&D system. We'll trace the path of electricity from a single power plant to the consumers in its local area. We'll start here, at the power plant. This is where electricity is produced or generated. It's the source of electricity for the local system and its consumers. From here, power begins its long journey to the homes, offices, and factories where it's used. From the power plant, electricity flows to the first major component of the TND system, the switchyard. The switchyard is used as a connecting point between the local system and the regional grid. Through the array of switches in the yard, electricity can be received from the grid or from any of the power plants in the local system.